my name is Wendy Francis. Last month, the Queensland Parliament passed new laws that make sharing or threatening to share an intimate image without consent illegal. The offence attracts jail sentences of up to three years and courts will also be able to order offenders to take reasonable action to remove or delete images or videos. Photoshopping someone's face onto a pornographic image will also break the law. These so-called revenge porn laws have been well received by women whose lives have been irrevocably changed because of intimate images that have been shared online. Effects of having pornographic images online obviously include experiencing difficulty gaining employment if potential employers see a link to a porn site. I'm really glad for the new laws, but they barely scratch the surface of the public health crisis which has been created by pornography. All pornographic images are a form of sexual abuse. The, the images that are taken and used are done with callous disregard for the subject. The distribution of photos can be humiliating and distressing for those depicted regardless of how an image was created or obtained. If you think about this, 88% of popular pornography shows physical violence and 87% of that violence is against women and it's not in significant forms of violence. What's more, Australian data shows a significant connection between violent pornography and our rates of domestic violence. Pornography is the antithesis of what God desires for humanity and that's why the Australian Christian Lobby will continue to campaign for our government to recognise pornography as a health issue which is causing physical, mental and emotional harm in our communities and to act accordingly. There's a need for education, for prevention, for research and policy change in order to address the pornography epidemic that is harming our nation and particularly our children. Policies such as age verification, ISP level filtering for online pornography, they would be a good start. But it's not just our government that needs to respond. Each one of us have a decision to make as to what our own response will be. Choose well and click the link in this post to keep informed and join the movement. Thank you.